here we are, and there it is. Where? I don't see it. It's down there. Oh, it's all brown and green and blue. What is it? Well, the people who live there call it the Earth. Shall we go? I'm right behind you. Okay, blink this way. This way. Okay. Ooh, where are we? What's that? This is a television station. Well, let's not stand out here freezing our points off. Let's go inside. Ooh, how'd you do that? Was that magic? It's an electronic effect. I'll get the door. Was that an electronic effect? No, that was magic. Ooh, I'm impressed. Wow, look at all the stuff everywhere. Gosh. Ooh, oh, security. I'm getting out of here. She can't see us. Let's go. What's that bush with all the twinkly twinklies on it? A Christmas tree. And what were those two round things on the doors outside? Christmas wreaths. Allow me. Gosh, you know, you do that real good. Thanks. Oh, what's that in the corner? That's an aluminum ladder. Uh, 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 uh. Come out of there. I am sorry, I have run out of ideas. That's where the executives work. Let's go this way. No, not there. CNN is not certain where the sports segment That's the sales place. office. Look at that. Sorry, it's a Bob. glass house. Not time for All right, hold up. The input system is there. What do you mean the No, team? that was the traffic office. Ooh, come on, quit hanging back. The boom out of here. I'm going to have to give you a wireless. Why did you say so? He started, man. I mean, well, listen, aren't we going to do something? Like a good deed or, or anything? No, we're going to watch a television special. What's a television special? Oh, shut up and follow me. No, 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 don't go in there. That's the studio. Camera two, pan left. Give me a tight shot, Ron. Susie babes, give me a level, huh? Come on, come on, come this way. Okay, I'm coming. Hey, what's the noise in here? That's ambience. Oh, what are all those little guys? Those are buttons. The bows are underneath. Oh, look at them. I'll turn it on. I want to see it. Come on, where is it? It's coming. Oh. Boy, it sure is loud and flashy. <laughs> That's television. Welcome to our first annual Turner Family Holiday Gathering. It's our way of sending special greetings to all of you who watch the Superstation and the Cable News Network. We hope you'll like it. And according to the elves, she is the brains behind the organization and the originator of Christmas as we know it. Well, actually, the whole Christmas spirit was Nick's idea. You see, he used to go all around the world in his sleigh shouting, Merry Christmas to all and to all a good night in that wonderful way of his. You know, even then he was jolly. But the next morning on Christmas, Marianne, he would have nodes on his vocal cords that were the size of baseballs. Mm. So that's what made you decide to give gifts? Well, no. No, actually, I was noticing the terrible unemployment problem up here among the elves. And a lot of them were trying to get on down at uh, Keebler Cookies. But they could only hire so many, you know. So, I came up with the toy idea. And it was a good one, too, if I do say so myself. You see, it gave the elves work and a sense of dignity. It saved Santa's throat. And not only that, I think it made Christmas a little nicer for the kids. Don't you think? Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. This is Claus. Please, now, call me Rowena, okay? All right, okay. Rowena. Last year, you received the Betty Ford Award. Tell me about that. Oh, Marianne, I was so proud of that. I really was. It said that I was the most outstanding woman behind the most outstanding man. Well, it's about time you got recognized. I mean, no one seems to notice you behind Mr. Claus. Well, of course not. He's huge, you know? I mean, I'm going to tell you something, and this may embarrass him, but I'm going to say it anyway. When I met that man, he was 175 pounds. But then he used to work out then, you know, on the weights and equipment and things. I guess it's just an occupational hazard. I don't know. I guess, you know, the kids leaving him the milk and cookies and things like that. We're on cable here, aren't we? Yes, we are. Could I just take a moment? Sure. Kids, this year, if you could please leave Santa some celery sticks and diet soda, I sure would appreciate it. Thanks. <laughs> well, we know. Yeah. Here at the North Pole, it, why do you stay here? It's such a cold and desolate place. The only place to eat is Nanooks around the corner, and that's a blubber bar. Why do you stay here? 
Well, Marianne, I guess I... I guess I just like to keep busy. There wasn't much to do before she got here, except sit around and swill down Coco. <laughs> she really, really pulled the whole place together. Santa's nice, you know? I mean, he's yeah. got a great heart and all that, but he could not arrange a deck of cards. That's true. <laughs> I remember, I remember one time when Santa was still single, we went over to his place to watch a little football. Talk about a mess. You would go into the kitchen or refrigerator to get you a can of Tiki Punch or something, and everything in it that was supposed to be brown was green, everything in it that was supposed to be... everybody and welcome to the TBS Sports Wrap-Off. This is Skip Carey along with Pete Van Weeren and Ernie Johnson. We're down to our two finalists in the All-Pro Wrapping Division and what a contest this is turning into. You're right Skip, you know we all expected Hank Aaron to make it to the playoffs and the wrap-offs but I don't think anybody expected an upset like that pulled by minor leaguer Bill Tush last week. Why don't we take a look at the averages? Hank Aaron, this season has a 387 wrapping average which is terrific in any season. But he picked. Hello, welcome to my show. I'm Sandra Snyder. Good to have you aboard. Christmas, what does it mean? Well, in this small studio, it sure doesn't mean much, as I can tell you. These Christmas decorations, what do you think they cost? A dollar ninety-five, two bucks, maybe? <laughs> Get back behind the camera. Okay, we've got a wonderful show for you tonight about Christmas. What does it mean? Tis the season to be jolly. City sidewalks, pretty sidewalks, may all your Christmases be. However, there is one minority that does not agree with Christmas or anything Christmas stands for. While I don't agree with their position and their stance on Christmas, I do believe that they have a right to be heard on my show. Sir, if you could whirl around here and tell us, what is it about Christmas that is your gripe? <laughs> There you have it. Gobble, gobble, gobble. The single voice of greed in a season of holiday giving. He said it. He meant it. I say it. I mean it. May all of you and yours have a very happy and safe holiday season. I said it. I meant it. Howdy! This is Cousin Minnie Pearl wishing you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year from all your friends at Superstation WTBS. Wish you a Merry oh, Christmas yeah, and a Happy New Year. Hmm. Wow. And we'd like you to join us, too. I, no, I'm the leader. I will start. Ready? We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Ho, oh, oh. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. And a Happy New Year. <laughs> we wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. I'm Robert Wessler, president of Superstation WTBS. And uh, sorry, I don't sing. I'm an executive. Oh, come on. Aww. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. I'd say. I'd say so too. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot the other line. We, we wish, wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Pack all your troubles, okay? Uh, Ted, uh, wrong song. We 
wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. What? Would you sing something for us? No! We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. Absolutely not. Okay. But if he's shooting and you're not telling me. We wish you a Merry Christmas. 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 A Happy New Year. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. Hello. Hi, Eddie. Oh, come on, Bob. Please. Well. Well, since it's Christmas, okay, I'll do it. Yay! We wish you a Merry Christmas, we wish you a Merry Christmas, we wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. We hope you've enjoyed this first annual holiday gathering of all of us here at the Turner Broadcasting System. We hope you have a happy holiday season. Thank you and good evening.